Yeah. Show Mark, show her what you were looking up. Wait, did you guys not start? Oh. Look, we were looking up this website. Look at what Mark found. It's free. <laughs> Look, it's follow it for says, free. It's OnlyFans. It says, you love big <laughs> That's what OnlyFans is guys, babies. <laughs> She's like, you've never been That's on OnlyFans. That's what OnlyFans is. I haven't seen it. Do gay and straight <laughs> terms. <laughs> or should we just gay do gay? Strip? What are straight terms? Like, touchdown. Oh, okay. Like, you didn't know what pull-out meant earlier. No, he, he mean, knew what it meant, he just had never... He didn't, <laughs> I never experienced it. He didn't know it. Like, <laughs> do we do gay, just gay terms, and then next week the straight terms, or...? What are straight terms? Like, touchdown, receiving end... <laughs> That's a gay term. That's not what it is. Receiving end. <laughs> on the moon. Hey guys. guys, what is up, what is up, welcome back to Gay Friends! Straight Friends! Where we do gay things! And straight things. <laughs> I guess. What, what gay things do you do? Yeah, what are the gay things that we do? <laughs> Besides... Oh, we're gonna react to terminologies of gay culture. Yes, so gay today, things. Mark, gay things. Mark wanted to, to test my, my gay uh, Terminology knowledge. Gay terminology knowledge. Yep, you know, it's a mouthful. I don't know a lot of a lot of terms or like slang or anything that like is used in the gay community to you know identify things that maybe yeah. I don't know. But Mark and I'm not is not also an expert. I'm not an expert. But you do know more than I do. Yes. Okay. We're gonna see about that because we have our correspondent, our resident, oh, off gonna, camera Haley today. If Woo! I lose, I'm gonna shame the gay community. I think they'll shame you. Wait, you I'll lose. wait. <laughs> That's not a very homophobic. <laughs> what I meant to say is I'll be ashamed. <laughs> I'll be ashamed to the gay community. I'm gonna shame to them. I'm gonna shame oh the gay God. community. <laughs> okay, first to five. First to okay. first to well, sixty-nine. I'll start. I'll start. No, not first to sixty-nine. <laughs> I'll start. We'll go uh, first to five. Okay. Uh, I said it before. Honored to be part of the series. Haley just wanted to get her voice on camera. I like to get my voice on camera. <laughs> Chill. I'm gonna start with something easy. This is for me. Okay, what is a twink? Okay, so a twink, um, as it's been explained to me, would be a uh, a man that is of the lesser stature, more skinny. What would you say, Mark? Yeah, that's a good one, and also maybe young. Oh, yeah, okay, so young. So it's a younger, smoother, cockier gay man. Oh. Can I get half of the points? We'll go <laughs> half. We'll split point. Half and half. <laughs> How are you going to draw that? <laughs> so you can't be an old twink. I think it's young. Usually, yeah, right? I think but you, young. I'm saying, what happened? Okay. An old twink's like I don't like know a, what a skinny old person is. Anderson Cooper. <laughs> 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 okay, this one's not on here. But I'm going to ask you anyway. What is... This is for Wade. What's, oh. a, what's a beard? What, what about me? A beard. You know what it is. A beard is a gay man that possesses a beard <laughs> and also is gay and he <laughs> is that. he is dominant. He a beard <laughs> is a guy that is takes care of him has, takes care of himself. He doesn't take care of himself. He's not he's not very because he has a beard? He's not very homely. <laughs> He's very, he's like the brawny man, like the paper towels. Okay. He's like, he, he's very scruffy. Eh. Eh. <laughs> what the hell with a beard? What is that? Okay, Mark. Mark. It's when, it's a girl who gets uh, consensually or maybe non-consensually used for uh, persuading the parents of that gay or just society that oh, they're straight. Oh, okay. Yeah. So if Mark pretended to date me, I would be Mark's beard. Yes. So you have like, been Mark's up. beard for yeah. the last... Year, yeah, like last year, year. Yeah. <laughs> we're going strong. <laughs> we're going strong. That's what did you no, get, Haley, no for the anniversary? No one noticed anything yet. <laughs> I really didn't know that. Okay. Interesting. What is a power bottom? A power bomb? Like power Batista bottom. in wrestling, where he just got boom. <laughs> power bottom. Power bombs sounds like what we were doing on a Saturday in my house. You understand? <laughs> <What's> <laughs> okay, a power. No, no, <laughs> me and me and Kels. Um, a power bomb. Mark, do you want to answer this one? Or do you know this do, one? Do, okay, okay. okay. A power bottom. I think I've been referred to as one of these jokingly in the G-Mini-O community. Um, it is, a, it is someone that is proud of their bottom status. 
In in college football, I played I played receiver. I was I caught I caught footballs. Power bottoms, I feel like, would be a proud receiver in the football terminology. <laughs> someone that's like a, someone that's like I'm a bottom and I'm proud, like SpongeBob. <laughs> I'm ugly and I'm proud. I know we're SpongeBob. I'm a bottom. And I'm, you know, like someone that's proud of of being the person that is the bot on the bottom. Uh, it is. Yeah. What is a power bottom then? So when a bottom can really, can take a big <laughs> and not cry or complain about it. Oh my god! <laughs> People use they terms power. like this? They have power. That's power. That's power. Wouldn't it be like an open bottom or something? Like, I know. I did not the know that that was that vulgar. Gosh, I yes. am getting my ass kicked. <laughs> this one's not that hard. Okay. I feel like you can figure it out. What's a beefcake? Beefcake is a, a muscled up gay person. Correct. Yeah. One that spends a lot of time at the gym. Yeah, beefed up. Let's go, Mark. I don't think either of you are going to know this. Oh, oh, I'm about to f listen. Okay. What is a unicorn? Um. It's like when. It's like a fetish. No? It's like when. Oh, no, it's like a, it's like a, a very feminine, hairy, beefy guy. Are you just describing what a unicorn is and then just saying guy at the end? <laughs> it's, a, it's a it's a it's a four-legged hairy beefy guy. Hairy beefy guy with the horn. That's a feminine. <laughs> a unicorn is uh, someone that believes in all possibilities. Um, they dream big. They have uh, big aspirations, and they are willing to point out each other's flaws. <laughs> and they also are. This is too wholesome. Gay. The reason I thought neither of you would get it because it's actually a bisexual oh, term. She oh, she slipped that. It's she a bisexual person that's willing to hook up with couples with no strings attached. Wow. Yes, they're called unicorns because they're hard to find, apparently. Really? Uh, what the hell did I not, how did I get that? Unicorns because you can't find them. That makes sense. It should, should be called, like, Love. the Waldo. That's hard. I didn't the know. Waldo. <laughs> the Waldo. Because you can't find them. That like a, isn't that like the, when you... What a Waldo? First off, why did Mark pull out the... It's like it was a fire hose. The man said, "When you know, when you What's pull out the Mark's like, when you pull it out of there." <laughs> oh my god! Power bottom, son. What's a U-Haul? Oh god! Is it? I don't look at me. Is it a a woman that uh, is extremely like macho? A U-Haul is. Oh, I bet that's what it is. A U-Haul is like a rebound. It's like a person that you use to get to the next person. Cause you would pack up your feelings and use them to oh, move on to your next spot. It's when uh, the woman is wearing a strap-on. <laughs> Mark just has these like and sexual it's like. It's like carrying the woman. <laughs> it's a, the other it's woman. Carrying the other woman. A U-Haul is a lesbian who moves fast towards living together. Oh, oh you're so, so close. So close. They, you they were so close. Really fast. Oh, like I was close. I got it totally wrong. <laughs> It's like when, when the dildo and hold someone, why you wear dildo to hold someone? That's what holds them. No, because you're standing <laughs> up. It's a nice little stool for them. Every one of Mark's explanations is a sexual position. All of it. Let's hear it. What do you got, hey? What is a platinum gay? This is, this is, uh, I think a gimme to you. You buy so many skins in a league that you should know this. You are the platinum gay. I think, yeah, it's like the ideal gay. Ooh. Any guesses? Uh, I mean, that sounds good. The platinum gay is like the elite of gay. I've like wait, wait, the ex the the it is a wannabe gay. Okay. A gay that wants to be more gay. I get. I don't know. <laughs> I think I think it's the ideal gay. I think it's, it's like it's like uh, the guy from Glee. I think I would call him platinum gay. <laughs> I would say Anderson Cooper is the platinum gay. Oh, so it's a gay oh, man. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Okay. I know. I know. Okay. I know. It's it's an it's a it's an old gay man. It has like white hair. I messed him up. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I messed him up. I messed him up. A what is it? A platinum gay is a gay man that was born via C section and has therefore never touched a vagina. Wow. Oh. Damn, I don't That's me! It. Wait, that's me! You were born by C section? I was. You were? I oh, was. Because you're a platinum gay. And on but a boat. Been... <laughs> <laughs> Define wig. Do you know it? Um, A wig. It's gotta be. Ooh. It's someone that you, it's someone that is fake. Somebody, a, a, someone that's gay that's very fake. Okay. That is like someone, 
someone that's like, um, oh, nice shoes, honey, and they really mean you're kind of an asshole. I think it's a way to applaud. A way to community. applaud? In the gay community. Like Show me. Wig. Oh my god, <laughs> you have such a nice shirt. Wig. Oh, okay, so so it's it's genuinely being like, congrats, like, yeah, yeah you know? you're cool. I thought it was like, what I said. No, I'm not saying, like, when I say wig, I mean I'm wigging on someone. Like, I'm about to go the fuck off, you know? I'm about to wig on you. But Mark's like, oh, nice uh, teeth, wig. Yeah. Like, slay. This is like a game to... <laughs> What five the, that we're never gonna get to. What is a bear? A bear is a very masculine, hairy man that Correct. is gay. Correct. Give me that shit, nice. Mark. <laughs> what is since, next? Since you didn't know wig, what is T? The T is. Why does he get to do it all? The T. Mark's so fake. The T is like the gossip. Yeah. Then, like when you when when you spill the That's tea or when you have the tea. It's when you have the drama, or you know the drama, or you talk or gossip about something. Like, I'm about to spill the tea, I'm about to tell you something you don't maybe know. This is not really so a fair test. it's actually a drink that originated in China. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> what does it mean to cruise? Ooh, that's interesting. Cruise? Yes. It's when you go on a steady pace. Um, for sex, right? No? No, okay. I was gonna say for a relationship, being at like, set on cruise control you would be like a relationship that's like, Moving forward, but at, at not the maybe oh. uh, an accelerated pace. At it's a nice, you, easy pace. It's when you sleep with random guys, like con constantly. I would like to hear Jamie. To seek casual gay encounters. Yeah. Gay, gay. <laughs> to seek she casual. Can't say, to seek. She can't say the word sex. It says guys, casual gay sex encounters, but she says to seek casual gay encounters. <laughs> okay. It's like, I got it right. I got it right. I got it right. And then, nice. Usually in restrooms. Are sometimes even by the corner street light, so you can regret them in the morning after. No chance people nice. are doing that by a corner street light. Oh, oh yeah, God. they are. All right, we'll wrap it there. We, I don't know if anybody won, but I, I think, think the viewing won. audience lost for sure. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Uh, so so what was the what was the final place? tally, Haley? We got four and Mark got two point five. Because <laughs> Mark was getting half points. I I thought we were gonna do technically like, Mark won. He yeah, got five. Technically, I thought we were gonna do like one for you, I know, one for I me. Know. And I just kept answering. If one point each, you would have tied. How? How? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Haley's math coming back to bite her. Two point five is one. five. If he got one point for every half point he got, he'd have five. One, two, three, four, five, one, two, What's three, five? three, four, five. You both got five points. But wait, you got half points. I got a half point, point for the first one. So, so Mark five. wins five to 4.5. Okay, we would have tied. Okay. We would have tied, but it's still. So, still, I don't know. <laughs> But anyway, um, Mark, what's your favorite term for the ones we broke down today? Oh, we should have done buzzy! Oh, what's pussy? I forgot, damn it. They told me to. Out? Something with a butt. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember. Is Mark, it like. Find pussy for us to end the video, please. <laughs> it's a boy <laughs> <laughs> There we yeah, go. My boy! There we go. Very nice. It. Very nice. Mark. I'm the gay one. <laughs> okay, um, we're gonna need a delete button on repeat for this video, but. Mark does win. My favorite term from the video uh, was a U-Haul. Oh, One, funny. because of Mark's ridiculous guess, <laughs> and two, because I got kind of close, and I've never heard of that term other than actual U-Haul trucks. What about yours? What was your favorite? Pussy. Are you sure it wasn't Where's Waldo, the one you made up? Oh, yeah, I like Where's Waldo. The, I, you should just call I that one Fire I, I, like, I like the Mark. You like the Okay, Mark <laughs> likes the Mark. Um, that is it for uh, today's Gay Friend, Straight Friend. We have, maybe we'll come back and do like, a, I don't want to bro terms, but like sports terms or something for Mark. I like the bro terms. We'll do like some sort of some bro -y slang to see if Mark can guess any of those. But we are moving out of the office soon with these. We're going to be doing some IRL content as well, so be looking out for that. So anyway, uh, yeah, we're all done for this one. Uh, this has been in, uh, gay friend, straight friend, where we do gay things and apparently straight things sometimes. <laughs> Until then, <laughs> bye, bye guys. guys. Apparently, Pete Davidson is, should be on that OnlyFans. Why? Apparently, he's got a, a piece on. A piece? Piece. What's that? He's got a, he's got a big old. Oh, he has a. <laughs> he has a penis. <laughs> is this going? Yeah, it's fine. Oh, we probably should restart it. <laughs> oh, he's kind of. Let's go. Well, I mean, we.